Rocking with PettyBlog.com. It's your boy Snoop D O Double G, and you are now watching the Petty Blog. I can't be on the Petty Blog. <laughs> oh my God! It just hit me. <laughs> Petty and T. I I I I was so dumb. <laughs> so they already know that I'm dropping the T. So let's get right into it. Offset has responded to Nicki Minaj's husband and goons, and more or less, he is laughing at him. <laughs> I'm getting out of shit, you <laughs> <laughs> you think so what do you think so I can't act like that, huh? Big Queen's uh, love. It's popping. I do. Uh, on that vacation. Yeah. You're planning your funeral. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, bro. <laughs> we up in our jets, bitch. Y'all didn't get that. Y'all didn't even stand outside. If you missed that story and exactly what happened, wait on it, I will explain it thoroughly. Y'all know we got y'all. Now, Cardi also hopped in one of the other goons DMs after she saw him talking about her and her man, her man, her man. But first, let's see what he was saying that made her confront him. He took to his stories and wrote the following. Y'all calling Nicki Minaj husband corny, but what's corny is ninjas that pop ish on the internet and behind your back, but when they realize Rokellas is out, they hiding and leaving early out the side door. Nah, B, stand on what you said. I don't want to hear no, how old is these people, etc. People, Cardi and Offset, been popping ish on the internet and behind people back, but when real killers is out, people be quiet and to claim they're not for the drama and sneaking out the side door. People be getting beat up and be crying. Copping, please, I seen it. Nikki had all them Brooklyn and Queens real killers with her that night and people were scared. The end. People being wild fraud in my comments right now, but when them killers come out, people gonna be like, Jeff, you got the business to run. I thought you changed. No, I'm still from Harlem, 128th Street, that be with mad Brooklyn and Queens killers. Ninjas will do you, done. Y'all gotta stop playing on the internet. Then he wrote, don't ever tell me I'm making this up. Sis and her husband was shook. Nikki had real street ninjas with her. Like I said, when them real killers is out, people simmer down. Then he posted this and said, she mad. And his DMs from Cardi replying to his previous story about y'all gotta stop playing on the internet. And she wrote, bozo ass B, what killers? You hear yourself talking? Isley brother head ass? You bragging about VMAs knowing that ish was packed with cops and hip hop police and kept everyone separated? I went out the same night and went out the night after. Afties in the Bronx and all that. I move around in my city comfortably. Grown ass man, what you wanna do talking about you getting out of retirement? Come show me, sir. Oh wow. Talking about you gonna do me, come do me then. And then he said, you mad? Then she said, nah, y'all is, I'm comfortable. Then he said, you mad about what I reported? Oh well. Then she said, nah, I don't know what you reported. I'm talking about them threats you making. Then he said, they said you and your man tiptoed out the side door in his Berettas and penny loafers. Then she wrote, them five stories of threats you made. Then he wrote, get out my DM girl and go finish dressing over Nikki cause you can't rap. No one made any threats to you ugly. Then she said, you a cornball. I see you ain't talking about ish. And he wrote, but I can tell you right now, you don't know who you effing with, so don't play with me because I don't know who you think you are. Then he continued, nobody's talking to you ugly. I'm talking to your ugly fans in my comments. You just want smoke because you mad. And she wrote, P-A-B, this ain't you making threats. One thing ugly is your B. Then he said, but play with me if you want and bet you get played with. And she wrote, you Larry the Lobster shaped B. And he wrote, your mama ugly, that long nose B. Oh, wow. Then she wrote, stop skipping leg day. And he wrote, you mad. And he also wrote on top of that, can't call me ugly and can't say I'm a bum, crying, laughing. Then he continued, my skin is too thick. You don't want to play the dozens with me. I will have you wanting to K yourself. Uncle Festa had to block me after she DM'd me popping ish. She couldn't keep up. Wow. I'm just a regular, regular, regular girl from the Bronx. And on his page, he also posted this picture of Cardi along with the DMs and captioned it. Here go y'all ugly ass fave in my DMs. Mad because the people said her and Offset was scared and slid out the side door with her eight security guards hovering them every angle. You mad? Go finish that face surgery so you can look like Nikki and go back to your session with your ghost riders because you can't rap. You are pathetic and pressed. Wow. Honestly, it's all uncalled for. But if you miss how it begun, let's rewind. Yeah, so the awards and everything, right? Basically, 
Basically, long story short, as we all know, Nicki Minaj was the host of the VMAs, right? But it was still business as usual. No matter who had a problem with her, they still had to come to work. For example, Cardi B. She still had songs to promote and a performance to do. So as far as Nicki being there, she saw it as it is what it is. Every time I turn around, I'm and I'm more than sure that they had stipulations to not cross paths. Very simple, right? Well, it should have been, except it wasn't that simple. Nikki was allegedly throwing shade from the stage. Should I be mean right now? It's Barbie. Bye. To the point where Cardi was like she didn't even flinch. You would just look up to me. You said you look up to her, but really you look up to me. Cardi was like she didn't even flinch, and Nikki's goons were outside the venue talking crap about how they outside, literally. That was shocking. And how Cardi and Offset was scared this and scared that. So when Cardi tweeted, I didn't even flinch, that's why you see the barbs under it like, girl, bye. You left early and you literally had 10 bodyguards. Oh, wow. But Nikki's goons ain't stopped talking since, and even her husband had some concerning things to say. And there's claims that Offset DM Ken's boys asking him where he at and a whole bunch of other tough talk, as y'all can see. They won't smoke if I see them, it's a smoke. I don't even know how all this happened. I had a great time, great experience. Everything was positive, you know what I'm saying? You know, like... Um, I guess they misinterpreted the, the the video that when me and Zoo made, and we was just talking shit like regular shit, like like Queen, Sturdy, all of that, everything like that. And then I guess Zoo made the comment like, you know, um, what was it? Oh, waiting for one of y'all niggas to act stupid, and that was it. The big Queen, Sturdy, biggest Queen, biggest Queen, nigga. Wait, wait, I was old, I was sad. Now, I guess Cardi wrote something in, in, in regards to that. She didn't even flinch or whatever. So Offset was in defense mode. And after writing, ask Cardi why she mad. Big queens in the building. We just different on this side. Real sturdy, diehard shit. Kenny's boy also posted the following videos in his story directly after sending that message. They should throw stones if you live in a glass house. And if you got a glass jaw, you should watch your mouth. Niggas talk on Instagram, but when they see us in person, they don't got the same reaction. None of these niggas are sad. None of these niggas pop out of my shows and I'm always posting up the address. Oh, wow. But chow is just too much and it's also unnecessary. Like, why can't we all just get along? And even fans are shocked that Nikki is letting Ken say such incriminating things out of his mouth so publicly. But y'all gotta remember, Nikki is still upset about that shoe that Cardi threw years ago. So that might be why she ain't put an end to the craziness and letting her man and his goons talk crazy. Hold up, bitch. Please don't touch me. And also keep in mind that even despite Nicki Minaj hosting, she still had time to be petty and like tweets about the fact that her and Cardi were probably about to cross paths that night. So when Cardi said we gonna be forever, Nicki's on the same wave. But I don't care how long it take to get her out back or my niggas outside. I don't know. If I was her, I would stop my man from doing all this talking. I'm just saying. And I know y'all want to see it. So without further ado, check it on out. That was shocked, man. Nigga, the sturdiest, nigga, big swing, biggest swing, nigga, long eyes. Ah, offset, where you at? That's it. Got to spin that shit. Them niggas at, nigga. They go Kanye, nigga. No, we shot, man. No, we shot, yeah. yeah. We outside! Big Zoo outside, outside nigga! Uh -huh. Big Queens, right? Yeah! 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 We outside, we run this city, nigga. Don't let these niggas fool you, we run this city, nigga. You see the addresses on the buildings, nigga. You see the plates on the cars, nigga. What's going on? What's happening? What's happening? What y'all niggas talking about? Yeah! What the fuck are you talking about, man? Yeah! Let's talk, man. Let's talk. Get out here. Yeah! Pussy ass shit. Yeah! Who y'all think y'all playing with, man? Yeah! Sturdy, nigga. Uh, uh, all, all the way. All the way. Sturdy. All the way. Sturdy. Stupid, nigga. Sturdy. Check the cereal number. The sturdy.
Yeah. Fuck y'all niggas yeah. Yeah. All the way. Ain't nobody Yeah. 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 That's them? Oh, no, that oh, ain't that them. No, that ain't them. <laughs> nah, spin, nigga. <laughs> you know that. And we out here. Oh, we... How long y'all want to be on us with us for us? Uh, how long y'all want to stay here, man? Until y'all niggas come. Hold on. How we add them niggas on there, man? You want to tell them niggas, man? Hey, man. We drop add them niggas in. Man. So yeah. you gotta drop a location. One of y'all, one of y'all add, add them niggas in shit, you heard? <laughs> tell them niggas, tell them niggas big suit, big suit, big queens outside, nigga. Whole gang outside. Tell them niggas. It's not a million niggas, nigga. It's just a million niggas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah,